from a very beautiful evening in Hoi An. So we are now in central Vietnam and the weather is a little bit rainy although we actually have not been rained off the entire time that we've been here. We had an incredible day today. We started off our day by going to the Mi Sun Sanctuary which was absolutely incredible and we learnt so much and we got to watch a performance of two different kinds of traditional Chan people dances. It was just such a great insight to the culture of the Chan people. It was absolutely incredible. Then we walked around the Chan people religious sites that had been built and they were absolutely incredible. One of the sites that we visited was 80% original so that was really amazing to see and we had a tour guide who taught us about how it was built and the traditions and customs that the Chan people had. It was just amazing and I really highly recommend getting a tour guide for those sorts of things because they're just able to tell you everything, any questions that you have they can answer. We really really appreciated having a guide for all of the tours that we've done. It's been amazing to get that first-hand knowledge and information from the local people. It's just, yeah, definitely worth it. <laughs> so that was incredible. And then we had heard about Tyler May Coast being unique to Hoi An. We went in, we just looked through some different designs that we might like and Ryan ended up getting two suits and I got a dress and a suit as well. It's amazing to say that I had it tailor-made in Vietnam. That's just the coolest thing. So after we chose our designs, we then chose the different materials that we wanted and we had our measurements taken, which was really cool as well. It was just such an amazing experience. I really, really valued it. Overall, we spent quite a lot, but in the long run, it's really well worth the price. A suit can cost so much on its own in Australia. After that, we then got some lunch. A few people had recommended us to go to Morning Glory and it was absolutely beautiful. Our tour guide today also recommended Morning Glory and it was really good. It was so nice and the atmosphere was really beautiful. And then at 5.30 we had a fittings appointment for our tailor-made clothes and we just told them what adjustments we wanted to make. It was just really fun and we partook in the tradition of getting into a boat and floating down the river and put little lanterns into the river. Hoi An is so, so beautiful and at night it's incredible seeing all of the lights twinkling around you. It's just magical. That was a really special experience. I think we're going to go back again tomorrow night and do it again since we're here. We almost got back to our hotel before we stopped for some manis and pennies. <laughs> so it's just been a really, really beautiful day. <laughs>
morning. It is our final night here in Hoi An, actually our final night all together in Vietnam. Uh, and it's been an incredible day. I had another fittings appointment with the tailor to have a look over the dress one more time. And I decided that I still wanted a few adjustments made. So we left it with them until four o'clock. We had lunch, we had an incredible meal with an incredible view. And then we actually took up a lantern making class. Our hotel connected us with a company that runs those sorts of classes. They're actually a lantern making company anyway. So we walked to that company and the people that were working there were so lovely. Really, really fun to hang out with for a bit of our afternoon. And the lanterns that we made, we were so happy with. It was so fun. And then at 4 p.m., as I mentioned, we went back to the tailor to do another fittings appointment for the dress. I was really, really happy with the outcome. They did such a beautiful job. Yeah, it was such an incredible experience and they're all really, really lovely there. And yeah, just really funny, you know, the, every time that we visited, it was just, yeah, a lot of fun, lots of jokes. We've just come back from a boat ride down the river where we We've got to put in some more lanterns into the water. We just had to do it again since we're here. The lanterns actually signify love, happiness, health, and good fortune. And now we're actually about to head off for a massage. It's been a really incredible day and it's been so sunny. We are truly so lucky because it is their rainy season at the moment here in Hoi An. Since Hoi An is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, it is very protected uh, and they're obviously wanting to preserve the architecture and the culture and things like this. So a lot of the businesses are built on tourism. It feels like Hoi An, the ancient town, is like a huge museum. That's the best way that I can describe it because as we were walking, we were noticing so many buildings that have been dedicated to little museums for things like medicine during those times. It was really incredible to just get to walk around and experience. The locals there were really, really lovely and very helpful. There were a couple of times where we were a little lost, but they were really helpful. It's been really a special addition to our trip. So we're really glad that we've come. Um, yeah, it's been a good day.